Hey guys, my name is Scobie. Today I'm going to be showing you how to archive and download all of your previously uploaded videos in one file. This is going to be a nice quick and easy tutorial. We won't have to save our videos individually one by one. Using this method, we're going to be able to get all of our uploaded YouTube videos really easily. And as you can see, I have quite a lot of them uploaded currently. So this method is really, really good. So the first thing you want to do is come to this link. It's going to be takeout.google.com slash takeout. And on this page, we're going to have access to select all of the Google services that we want to archive and select information from. In this case, we have information from Drive, Google Docs, Play Store, Hangouts, and a bunch of other things. But in this case, we're going to be focusing specifically on YouTube. To do this, we're going to be going to the very top and we're going to start by clicking select none. This is going to disable all of the backups and we're only going to be focusing on the YouTube one. From here, we're going to want to go to the very bottom and we're going to have to check and enable our YouTube option right here. From here, you have the option of including all of your YouTube data or you can select specific data if you wish. In this case, I'm going to be including all of my YouTube data, but this is up to you. And you can also change your subscriptions from an OPML file or a JSON file. This is also up to you, but in this case, I'd recommend the default. From here, you want to click the next option, and then we're going to have some more options to look around in. The first thing you have to do is select the file type you wish to use. In this case, I just recommend .zip. Then you'll have to select the archive size you want it in. In this case, you can choose 1, 2, 4, 10, or 50 gigabytes. In this case, I'm going to be choosing 50 as I have a lot of uploaded YouTube videos. And I will give you the warning that zip files over 2 gigabytes will be compressed in a zip 64. So some operating systems may struggle with this. If you're on an older operating system or you don't have a lot of videos, maybe it's better to keep your archive size to 2 gigabytes. And then finally, we can choose the delivery method. We can send a download link via email, add it to our Google Drive. Depending on how many videos you have, I would recommend uploading it to Google Drive. It'll make it a lot easier to share and download your files. In this case, I'm just going to be sending the download link directly to my email. Then from here, all you want to do is click Create Archive. And you'll be brought to the next page where it'll give you a process timer on how long it'll take to archive all of your information. It'll give you a percentage slider right here, and it'll also show you how much data is currently collected. Now, depending on how much data, videos, and other information you have on your YouTube channel, this can take quite some time. And after some time, your archive should be fully completed. From here, we can click Show Exports, and we'll have the option to download our archives. As you can tell, I currently have two parts of my archive, both are just under 50 gigabytes in size. To download them, all you want to do is click the download button and your download will begin. Anyway guys, it's that easy to download all of your YouTube videos. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new, check out the other videos on the channel. I'm going to be leaving a link down below to my PayPal if you found these videos helpful and you want to support me. I make all these videos for free, so if you want to help me keep making them, I'd really recommend checking it out. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, as always, keep it saucy. Peace.